I don't know if you can see it, can you see it there? It's running right, nothing wrong with it. It's running great at the moment, but just got a fuel leak and every so often it'll spill out and it starts stinking in the uh, in the cab. So I can't get the uh, parts for it at the moment because we're on lockdown and uh, Ford parts are not open. I mean, it needs the Ford parts doing. So as soon as I can get it fixed, I'll get it back on the road properly. Only going short distances in it, but it's uh, that one, the rusty, you say. I took a photo, I'll show you a photograph. I've got a photograph of uh, of everything, uh, of this box completely off, so I'll show you that. See you later. Bloody steam coming off that. Yeah. I know, yeah. Jesus. I think you'd have been up by now. I think it would have done. Yeah, right, with that. Yeah. It would have been done three months ago. It had not been for bloody lockdown. These are easy enough to get to, aren't they? Yeah. Going ahead with the rest of them, or yeah. Well, I'm trying to get hold of them, but I've, well, I don't know whether I've got second hand or buy new ones, right? I mean, you can get decent enough ones, yeah. It's very rare you see these fail to be fair. It's the bleeding afterwards that causes problems, doesn't it? Yeah, I'm hoping it's not going to be too bad to be fair, yeah. So you don't put any PTFT tape on them or anything? They just seal in with the with the tightening. Like right? um, um, right, right, right. So that like crushes round it. Yeah, seals it. Could do with the bloody steam clean now, couldn't it? Yeah. Uh, oh crap. Fans a little bit, does it though, isn't it? Yeah, when I was a kid, I used to go, we used to go to uh, Farmworth and uh, there was a guy there, he used to put the pipe through the um, through the railings and steam clean our cars for a tenner. Yeah. <laughs> then were the days. Jim's got him apart from the rest of them. Yeah. 